in an intensifying threat landscape, protecting your business assets from viruses, malware, and phishing attacks becomes increasingly important. But managing a secure gateway and internet traffic, all the while trying to keep your customers happy in a seamless user experience can seem like a difficult task. Today, we're gonna to show you how IBM Data Power Gateway helps businesses meet their security and integration needs with its newest user interface. Our new user experience is designed to minimize the learning curve for developing, managing, and implementing robust policies for your gateway. We'll walk through a scenario showing how IBM Data Power Gateway can authenticate, manage sensitive data exposure, and protect backend systems. In this example, let's say you're an IT specialist for a mid-sized e-commerce platform that specializes in the buying and selling of woodworking products. You want to help ensure that both the customer and the seller, as well as your backend internal systems, are protected through your gateway. As your company grows, the user base expands and the number of potential cybersecurity threats increases. This can put a lot of strain on your IT teams and infrastructure. Here's how IBM Data Power Gateway can help. The new Data Power user interface is designed to make managing gateways both easy and accessible. It also includes new features, making it faster, and it provides even more feedback with a new transaction probe with complete debugging capabilities. So let's say you're developing some custom code to implement new security enhancements. As your internal systems become more complex, the number of ways to configure the simplest task grows exponentially. Your team may have to dedicate months of their time to implement these new security protocols. With IBM Data Power Gateway, businesses can easily protect Simplify, govern, and optimize the delivery of services with a powerful drop-in gateway engineered to reduce development cost and mitigate business risk. So let's create some policies and see how that works. Let's say a customer wants to buy a rocking chair from your company. What's the first thing they do? Log in. So let's create a policy for that. A processing policy defines what the gateway does and how it's protected. That's achieved by setting rules. We're going to go into the policy and create a rule. This rule writes a policy that will both authenticate and manage sensitive data exposure. The matching rule looks for the request to come in. The lock symbol, the, the AAA, is an authentication process. The gateway script is a transformation doing a custom redaction. And in this case, it redacts the credit card number. This also acts as a filter for the credit card number. Our sensitive data rule separates sensitive data we may not want to share between the customer and the woodworker. And the results sends that whole transaction back to our woodworker. The next rule writes a policy that protects backend systems through service level monitoring. This enforces a set of actions to take when the traffic thresholds have been reached. The service level monitor can lock a customer out and put them in a penalty box. For this example, we made it so the customer could only inquire about the status of their rocking chair three times every 10 seconds. Let's see if it worked. We're going to test the transaction on Postman, which is just a simulation of what it would look like behind the scenes on a web browser. The information on the top is the information that the customer puts in, and the information on the bottom is the woodworker's response. The send button sends the transactions. Simulating the customer, I'm going to log in with my username and password, and let's see if it logged in. Great, it worked. Now let's see what happens when I put an extra character on my password and try that same thing. Oh, it didn't work, meaning our authentication policy is good to go. Now let's check the status of the rocking chair. We created a rule so that I can only ask for the status of the order 
three times every 10 seconds. So let's see the fourth time. It doesn't work. The transaction doesn't send and I get locked out. Meaning again, my rule is good to go. This feature can be customized to any dimension within your gateway process. So you can set the parameters that is best for your business. On top of these capabilities, IBM Data Power Gateway also includes a meticulous transaction monitoring tool. We can see the transactions that didn't go through have a red X. So right away, we know something was wrong. With this complete transaction logging tool, we can click on a transaction. Let's click on one that worked. And immediately we can see every step of the process. So here you can see the authentication process. The incoming message is right next to the outgoing message. You can see that it's changed. Our sensitive credit card data is now start out. Today, we showed you how IBM Data Power Gateway can authenticate, manage sensitive data exposure, and protect backend systems. The results? Increased productivity, more agile security policies, and a faster response time. Without a need for an abundance of custom code, your resources can now more easily execute security enhancements. Businesses not only need low code tools to accelerate integration, but also require an innovative approach to application security to support their digital transformation. IBM Data Power Gateway partners with organizations in over 80 countries, 40 different industries, and partners with over 400 financial firms worldwide. That's why our industry-leading solution is a trusted global partner, empowering businesses with the highest level of protection. Thank you.